Hello everybody. Today's gonna be a fun day. I'm actually going to meet Danica and Ellie, who is Girl in Alaska and Ellie in Alaska from Instagram. They are doing a meetup today. As you guys know, I just met Ellie for the first time and I followed her for a very long time. She came up to me in Costco and I was so glad to meet her. <laughs> girling anyways I'm um, gonna go hang out say hello I don't know how long I'm gonna be there um, but I've never met Danica before she is an Instagrammer she does like Alaska travel stuff and she's up here in Fairbanks just kind of fun to meet with other people that kind of do similar things I know I vlog I feel like the social media world is just weird <laughs> I don't know it's a it's a weird world to be in it's just kind of nice to hang out with people and meet people that kind of get you I have to do some shopping some Christmas shopping before I go there and possibly after there's like a lot of stuff I still have to get and it is the Sunday before the last Sunday before Christmas so uh, I'm a little bit behind so I'm gonna be doing some shopping and then head to a meetup and then we're gonna come home and do something fun with the kids so I think I talked about these. He's unloading the dishwasher, so you're gonna have to excuse the sound, it's just real life. <laughs> but I think I mentioned in a couple videos ago, maybe last video, um, I had gotten some stuff from Woodlands. I forgot to show you guys. So these are the little gloves. If you look really close, there's like a pink hint to these gloves. Also, they have like the smart, smart tips where you can still use your phone, which is very nice. These aren't just like a, a regular knit glove. They're fleece lined. Well, I'm excited for these. Um, and then also she had this hat and I could not help myself. As soon as I saw it, she posted on her Instagram, which she has a shop, but it wasn't on her website yet. I messaged her and I was like, I need one of those hats. Look at this hat. <gasps> it's like the Carhartt style. I don't know, beanie. I don't know. Um, it's like the Carhartt style, but it says stay wild and it's pink and I love it so much. I don't know why it's coming out all loud and squeaky. As you guys saw, it is over 20 below right now, which is so cold, which means my car will probably not shut off the entire time I'm gone and that is okay. All right, I'm slightly nervous because I'm like an awkward social person, but I gotta get going. I have some shopping to do. Let's go. This is my go-to, if you're new here, Fred Meyer is my all-time favorite place, and if I was to ever be sponsored by anybody, it would be Fred Meyer's, because you can literally get anything in there. <laughs> all right, so I can talk to you a little bit more, but um, just a kid warning if you have kids around, okay? Maybe don't. I am getting stocking stuffers, and um, my kids actually know that we do the stockings. Um, some families don't do that. That's why I gave the warning. Anyways, uh, gonna be getting stocking stuffer stuff for my kids, for Lance. I know he's already gotten mine. So sweet. He took Addy shopping the other day, and I just know. Okay, I just know. He told me that Fred Meyers had a lot of stocking stuffer stuff. I've gotta get something for my mom and dad, which I don't even know what I'm gonna get yet. <laughs> They're like people that have everything and if they want it, then they just buy it. And they're just pretty simple people. They don't really want a lot. So um, not gonna be showing you guys what I get my parents though because they do watch my vlogs. Love you, mom and dad. Not really gonna be showing you a ton of what I'm getting just because I don't want you guys to see things before like my kids get to see them. Like that's no fun for them. So, uh, but I'm gonna bring you along a little bit. I'll show you some stuff that I'm looking at and just kind of that stuff. I also need shampoo and then I forgot chapstick and lip gloss, anything for my lips. I put some on before I left, but it when it's this cold, like you guys, we're it's so cold. You have to have chapstick on. Just let me let me just show you what our forecast is like right now. It's just a gem. So we're basically in a deep freeze right now. Sometimes when it drops to 20, 30, some say 40 below, it just kind of stays there until the inversion is gone and then it gets warmer again. The one really amazing thing about 20 and 30 below, 
is that it's sunny. I actually haven't seen the sun in a while because we've been so warm, we've gotten snow. Um, warm to us means overcast, sunny means cold. <laughs> Normally well below zero. So I'm excited for the sunshine. It's actually quite nice right now, even though it's dark most of the time because we're about to hit the shortest day of the year. We are currently at three hours and 42 minutes of daylight. But it's not a lot of light, guys. Like, the, the sun that we do get is normally just the tips of the trees. Like, <laughs> it's just not a lot of light. All right, I'm actually running behind. The, the meetup is in an hour. Um, I mean, I think it's just kind of like come and go. So I'm not really too stressed about getting there right at 2 o'clock. Also, my van's disgusting because it's been so busy. That's one thing I need to tackle soon is getting my van cleaned out because it's so bad. You can't see. You can't see anything. But uh, I'm pretty sure you could survive in this van for a while off the amount of food that's in here. All right, that's gross. My little Viper remote, that's like the long distance one, and it runs for like 40 minutes versus the 15, is um, dead. Like, this is just dead. It doesn't need charge. I don't know why I still have it on here, but they're like $175, I think, to replace. So I haven't replaced them yet because it's Christmas and Christmas is expensive. I do have an auto start on this one. It just won't start unless I'm like right next to the car. So a lot of help that is. All right, let's go shopping. <laughs> vlog very much because it was just like insane in there um but Fred Meyer is always so good about being stocked they had everything there was only like one thing I could not get so I was very thankful for that they had they were running out of stuff and as soon as they run out of it there was like people stocking the shelves it was amazing um, I'm really grateful that I went here and not normally I try to go to like Walgreens because they have a lot of like tinkery stuff that's for stockings Anyways, okay, I need water. All right. It's actually 2 15 So I gotta run to downtown which is not very far away and go to the meetup <laughs> you guys uh I did not vlog there were so many people in there you guys like probably I don't even know there was a lot and I am socially awkward okay like I know I can talk to the camera but if you put me in a group of people I'm going to shut down <laughs> not shut down but it was really cool to get together with other people in the realm of YouTube, Instagram, TikTok. I was talking with a photographer about getting pictures taken, which is something I've been looking for. It was just good to be around people and people that understand it. I don't know. It was so nice. I got to see Danica, which is Girl in Alaska on Instagram. I got to see Ellie, uh, or I, she goes by Lizzie. I just found that out tonight, so. <laughs> Sorry, Lizzie. I got to see Amanda there, which is at the Baskin Adventures. Um, she just climbed Mount Everest too, so super cool. It was just really good to be around joy-filled people. Could not have come at a better time. So anyways, I'm sorry I didn't get any footage. I'll throw you into some pictures that I took tonight. at home we have some gingerbread to do and some things okay bye are starting on the gingerbreads right now they're kind of taking a knife and kind of pre-cutting even though they're kind of cut 
there it's the mini village that we're doing I saw this on TikTok and we're gonna try it out it's where you just take sugar and melt it down and it creates basically a candy and it's supposed to set the gingerbreads up really fast so we're gonna test this out I actually had a pan that I was about to donate in case the sugar burns um, it's it's pretty scratched okay not looking super scratched on there but well, we don't like bits of pan in our food okay <laughs> anyways I was gonna donate the pan and I figured this is the best way to test it because if it doesn't work out we throw the pan away <laughs> guys um honestly i'm fighting a crazy headache today and this is what dinner is going to be because honestly i haven't done any shopping in like a week and a half which i normally go once a week we're just very slim my fridge is just cookie dough right now from last night anyways this is what we're having this is it I had smoked sausage in my fridge and I had baked beans in my pantry and I was like, we're gonna have beanie weenies for dinner. Um, except smoked sausage instead of hot dogs. That is dinner tonight. <laughs> I'm probably gonna just kind of rest the rest of the night. All I did for this was cut up the smoked sausage and then I browned it in the pot and then I dumped in two large cans of baked beans and we're calling that dinner. <laughs> kids had a good time and to be honest um, I took some videos of Lance and the kids and they did their gingerbreads but I actually had to go lay down because I had such a terrible headache I just laid down on the couch so I could still watch them and enjoy just like seeing him do everything um, I just want to be real real because you're not going to see any of that behind the camera um, that I just could not do a gingerbread and sometimes that's how it is I think it's okay if dad does some Christmas things with them and has those memories of just them doing Christmas stuff. Honestly, it's probably less stressful because I'm not like, ah, because things are going everywhere. You guys saw like how messy it got and um, mess causes me to be cranky, which is so weird because like my house is always a mess, but I don't know how to explain it. I'm really trying to like minimize my house right now. So there's just less stuff because I've realized and even research shows that when people have too much stuff or a messy house it's very hard on their mental health and I want my kids to not be stressed out and I want to be less stressed out and all of that. Today was actually a lot of fun and I know I didn't I just didn't show you guys a ton. Getting to meet Danica today was so fun. I am going to leave everyone's Instagram down below 
that I met today and I'm sorry if I didn't don't find yours if I met you. It was so much fun to just mingle with everybody, like I said before, you know, people that understand what world I live in, in such a, a weird world. And you know what, something I noticed was in a room filled with social media people, influencers, if you will, um, I didn't see anybody on their phone. I didn't see cameras out. I didn't see phones out. It was just people that wanted to connect and honestly, it was just so refreshing to see that. I love the community part of social media and some people just get very sucked into it and that's all they eat, sleep, breathe, but that was not the case here. It was a room filled with women that wanted community and they wanted to talk with other women and connect and I just love that. I actually have jury duty tomorrow. I've had jury duty this entire month and <laughs> I got called for tomorrow. So that's what tomorrow is going to be. I don't know if I'm gonna pick up the camera or not. My wonderful dad is going to be coming over and watching the kids. Luckily, I don't have to be to the courthouse until 1.30, which is actually so nice. Court doesn't go longer than tomorrow, but I guess we'll see. That will really throw a wrench in my week before Christmas. <laughs> but that's all right. All right, I am going to end this one. Thank you. If you are still around to this very piece together vlog, hit that like, hit that subscribe, and we will see you in the next video. Bye!